Today I wanted to show you how you can enable and disable WhatsApp notifications at certain times. So for example, if you want to only receive work notifications from WhatsApp while you're at work, you can do that. So to start off, let's just receive a normal notification. And here you can see a, a normal notification that you can see that belongs to the group notifications channel. Um, you can change this this group and but the problem is it will change the, the settings for every group for every existing group so to change that let's go into this group info and choose this custom notifications option and enable now this created a new uh, notification category here called my group which is the name of the group and now we can configure it configure whatever you want about this group so let's try receiving a new message now as you can see as you can hear uh, the new notification sound played now we can configure we can um, configure this in Tasker as well. Let's try it out. So open Tasker and let's test it out. Like test WhatsApp custom something like that, and then use uh, sorry use auto notification categories which allows you to change notification categories from other apps you you want to filter by um, group name in this case my group and by the app which is whatsapp so for the whatsapp my group notification category uh, do something with it. In this case I want to for example disable. Use this importance or disable to set it to disabled. And now let's see. I have another uh, notification here and if I run this task it doesn't work. <laughs> Uh, why not? Let's see. Importance? None. Disabled. Let's try to, to change it to minimum. See if that works. Also doesn't work. Why not? My group. Hmm. I must be doing something wrong. Group. Oh, yeah, it's not group name. It's name. Because group name is. <laughs> this is a bit confusing because group name is the, the uh, group name of the categories in notifications. And I wanted to change the group name, the notification category for the WhatsApp group. But it's not a group name in the categories, it's a group name in WhatsApp. So. <laughs> You have to set it in name here, and that should work. So oh, let's set it to disabled again. And now, if I run this, there it goes. The not notification is gone. And now I'll send another not notification, and nothing appears here. So imagine I'm off. I'm at work now, and I want to enable it. Let's set it to high again run this and now if I receive here you go and you can do this for contact as well for example I have this contact which is myself view contact and here we have custom notifications and just by enabling this and going to settings you can see that there's a new 
notification category called João Dias. And now in Tasker, wait, let me just uh, receive a message from, me from myself. <laughs> There you go. This is my message. And now if I change this name to this, oops, I can now modify it to disable it, for example and notification goes away. If I set it to high importance again, it comes back. So this way you can configure it uh, to automate it. So for example, let's see, let's say that um, whenever dark mode is enabled, which is at night, for example, Let's see, for example, dark mode. When dark mode is enabled, you want to. Oops, sorry. You want to enable. No, you want to disable the category because I, you don't want to receive notification from a certain group. So, again, my group. Oops. And at night, when dark mode is enabled, disable it. And then in the exit task, when dark mode is disabled, we want to bring it back to high importance. Or you can also change the sound, the vibra uh, vibration pattern anything you want to uh, in this condition but in this case we'll we're, we're just disabling these notifications when dark mode is enabled and enabling them when dark mode is disabled so let's mark this as red and now if I receive a notification from the group hello <coughs> notification is here but if I enable dark mode Bye bye notification, and I'll send another message, and I won't receive the notification. If I disable dark mode, I receive the notification again. Well, there you go. That's how you can automate receiving or not receiving WhatsApp notifications. Hope you enjoyed it. Bye.